Dear civil engineers, we all know about ASCE, American Society of Civil Engineers. So, if you are a student, then if you want to take some access from their website, then you can create a student account. And after creating a student account, you will get a student membership that is absolutely free. So, in this lecture, I am just going to show you that how we will do that. So, to do that, is a website asce.org you can come here and i will just put that link in description otherwise you can search here simply asce as student membership okay like that then enter after that you see a website like www.asce.org student chapters so simply click here and when you come here you will get a interface like that and what will just I mean how you benefited from that website you can read here everything is available here what is the benefit or uh, what is the benefit for a student okay and when you will complete your graduation or anything then you'll be able to update your membership so now i'm just going to create asc membership is free for a student okay so if you have already account then it's okay otherwise click here join asc now you just get another website or page then give here your gmail id or email id so i'll give here my email okay already i have an account but i'm just showing you that how we create account and after creating that account already i mean i will just delete that account so here okay so here i have just provided my another gmail id then click here continue if you already have the account then it's okay otherwise you'll see that box here so first, first of all just see country or region so if you are from united states then it's okay just fill that form otherwise click here to change so for my case i'll change that okay here i'll select my country now i will start from top so email location what is the email location work or home so i'll select home then name pre prefix so what will be the name prefix you can select from here so i am selecting uh, that one eng that means engineer first name So here you have to give your first name last name then name suffix if you have any then country and here this is address type home work or business so home then here address line already i have address here so i'll put it and see everything is here now you have to give your phone number here so i'll just give my phone number Okay, done then here you have to just put a password so I'm just giving a password okay so you choose same password here and after that click here and click next and wait for some time so when it's done now you will just give two options tell us about yourself so professional membership if you want to take professional membership then it's okay otherwise you'll be able to take 
student membership in order to be a student member you need to provide educational information so here student membership okay after that here demographics you can give a birth date gender job title so click here edit you have to put here your birth date so i'll just give here okay and gender male and job title if you have then you can give it the same after that add educational background so click here to add educational background so you can just give it country i'll change that country okay so school name You have to provide here your school name. When it's done, then click here find a school. So here it's telling us that is not in the database. If this is not available, then simply click here continue. Okay, then select degree from here that is Bachelor of Civil Engineering and here you have to put graduation date. So probable date is you have to select a probable date here when your graduation will complete. So I'll just put here. is done and simply I'll click here save when it's done uh, you'll see here it's okay then if you have that attachment or license if you have anything you can add I'll just go next so after that you will just give a option here society student membership dues from here you have to select your section you can select section which is appropriate for you so i'm selecting bangladesh section due and here as i'm student using student version then it's not charging any payment so i'll just click here yes i want to auto renew my membership when it will go I mean when it will just over its validation when it's done just simply click next so after that they have many institute okay so it's telling us first institute selected will be free so you have to select any of that institute from where you want to take or you want to increase your knowledge so they have many I like to joint structural engineering institute memberships or they have construction institute membership they have many actually so i am to join in construction institute membership and you'll see it's free it's totally free so when it's done and they have would you like to contribute no i don't like to contribute at this time when it's okay then click here sign me up so after completing your all process you'll see that then simply click here I'm not a robot so I'll select that course works next then traffic light bicycle here one so when it's done click here verify and 
Finally, click submit and wait for some time. So when it's okay, okay, when it's okay, just see your membership is okay. I mean your account have been created. Just see your membership. I mean your account have been created. So just see here total price and your account is okay now by clicking here join or just see here already you are signing okay so for education and i'll create another lecture that how we take access for different types of things here okay so thank you thank you very much stay connected to next video